How does your media product represent particular social groups? Well, um, there's two social groups shown in our media opening. Um, these are the detectives and the police force, and black people and females. We uh, have connected detectives and police together because they're basically the same thing. We've also detective black. We've also connected black people and females together because we have a black female in our opening. But firstly, um, when we decided to make the character detective, we knew that we didn't want to um, show the police force in a bad view. This was just because they, we didn't want the audience to think that we were. Um, that we were thinking bad of the British police force. We chose to have the characters as an alcoholic and suffering with depression to show their pressure, to show the pressure and stress of the job. So instead of showing the whole of the police force, we wanted to show an individual in the police force. Um, I think our opening shows the police force in a multicultural and non-gender specific um, role. This means that the police force don't discriminate if you are a a woman, or if you are black, or if you are Asian, or if you are gay, or if you are um, straight, anyone can be in the police force, and that's what we wanted to show because that's the truth. We didn't want to do a bad stereotype that all police people are white. That's not the case, and we wanted it to be as real as possible. So by doing that, that's why we chose the um, the detective in the police force. Um, the next part, the next social group is black people and females. Um, in our opening, we see these two in our one protagonist. Um, black people in films are usually shown uh, doing the crime and stealing and uh, kidnapping and everything to do with crime. They are usually shown doing that. So we thought it'd be very interesting to flip it on its head and have the black a black person on the other side of the law, which we also see in um, in normal life, but it's not it's not seen as much as a white person. Um, so we oh yes, we also wanted to um, show that she could have a well paid job because being a detective is a well paid job. So we wanted to show that black people can have well paid jobs because stereotypically they're poor or they want to be rappers and stuff. We, we, we wanted to take the stereotypes and completely just change them so that they wasn't there anymore. So this is why we shown her in a um, this is why we shown her in a well decorated room, uh, obviously has lots of money to afford all that alcohol and still live in her nice apartment. Um, she obviously drives to work so we so she come from behind cars. She's well dressed, even though we chose to have her ill-fitted clothes. They're they're well made clothes, which shows that she has money. So we want we just wanted to change the stereotype completely. Uh, and some people may think that making her masculine shows that black females are masculine, but that wasn't the case. With that was just a personal thing for us that we felt that. If we didn't do that, then our storyline wouldn't have come across very well.